Before I begin the next story, I want you to picture a scene, a dystopian world where humans have been replaced by humanoid robots. And there are robotic dogs in place of pets. Sounds freaky, right? But soon it could become a reality. Over the past few years, China has reportedly produced legions of robotic dogs armed with machine guns that are joining military exercises. Meanwhile, an American startup called Figure AI has developed a humanoid robot. The likes of Jeff Bezos, Nvidia and Microsoft have invested $675 million in it. Is this the next level of technology or the beginning of the end? Our next report tells you. Qin Shi Huang was a famous Chinese emperor. Upon his death, he was buried in a tomb with 8,000 life-size terracotta soldiers poised for battle. It was a replica of the king's actual army. The tomb complex was built more than 2,000 years ago, but China has come a long way since. If it were to create a similar complex today, you would not find terracotta fighters there or richly adorned chariots and weapons because it would most likely be full of dogs, an army of canines. Not a pack of live pups, we're talking about robo-dogs. Over the past few years, China has produced legions of robotic dogs. These are four-legged machines. They kind of look like tap-dancing insects or dystopian houseflies coming for your electronics. Either way, these robo-dogs are grabbing the world's attention. They're being used as electronic pets. They can be used to carry out mundane tasks. For instance, if you want that remote but don't want to get off the couch and don't have a sibling to boss around, the robo-dog can help you out. These robots have been used even by the Xi government to police strict lockdowns in China. But that's not all they can do. Recent reports claim that these dogs can be weaponized, armed with machine guns. They are now joining military exercises. Many critics dismiss these videos as propaganda by Beijing, saying that these robots have a slight build, they cannot handle bulky firearms, and even if they do, they will not have the speed and precision of trained soldiers. So far, no one is sure if these robotic dogs can outshoot seasoned troops. But America is not taking any chances. It sees vast potential in the technology. Last year, the US Marine Corps bought many units of these Chinese-made robotic dogs, mainly to evaluate their combat effectiveness. With the American government focusing on these robotic dogs, big corporations there are creating robotic humans. We're talking about Figure AI, a startup working to build humanoid robots. It was founded in 2022, and it has already developed a robot, Figure One. It looks and moves like a human. It is attached to a tether. It walks on two legs. It uses five-fingered hands to perform an activity. As you can tell, the robot is still in its nascent stage of development. It is supposed to be a general-purpose robot to be used in manufacturing, shipping, logistics, and warehousing. With more robust AI systems, this humanoid can significantly impact the world, and tech giants know it. The likes of Jeff Bezos, Nvidia, and Microsoft have invested in Figure AI. The startup raised $675 million this week, and it is valued at $2.6 billion. Some say this is just the beginning. The humanoid robot market is supposed to reach $38 billion by 2035, though some fear the flip side. They say, much like robotic dogs, humanoid robots can be used in warfare. And if misused, their dangers would know no bounds. So far, Figure AI has said that the humanoid robot is not intended for military applications. Intended. That's the operative word. Because, as the proverb goes, the road to hell is paved with good intentions.